Hawk is here with a uh, chicken hawk farmstead, and I went and did it again. Uh, once you get that itch, you gotta you gotta go with it. Sometimes, uh, got me another storage unit. Uh, this one's a very small one, so uh, it's gonna be super easy to clean out. It should only take a few minutes, and just brought the truck today. No trailer, just gonna throw it in there. We'll go through it really quick, but uh, not in depth at all. I just got to grab it and go. And, uh, yeah, there was another one I was bidding on this same facility, a, a big one. Ran him up a good 100 bucks or so this morning, but didn't get it. Had a lot of good stuff in it, but it's the way it is. I mean, you got to look at how much time it's going to take you to dig it out and everything. And, uh, yeah, this one, like I said, we'll go through it real quick and see what's in there. All right, this thing uh, ran me, like, right at 60 bucks. I guess 70 with that. Yeah, so $70. But, you know, main reason I got it, we got mini fridge. I'd say it's a good 25 bucks without a problem. Uh, this thing should work. People usually don't store TVs that don't work. It's a Vizio, looks like about a 32 inch. That'd be good for a computer monitor. I mean, that's good 30, 40 bucks, if not 50 even. Uh, got some clothes and stuff. Here's one of the things I saw. They did have these shoes. It's a pair of Jordans and look at the sole didn't even look like they were ever hardly worn so got two of those another pair of nikes oh what we got down here hold on it's like some is this another pair ah. yeah they don't look like jordans but still looks like a champs nice pair of shoes there ah, camelback nothing fun dvd some other DVD. Yeah, good taste in music or uh, videos though. Look at that quarantine. Is that in there? Yeah, I like that movie. So, all right, and then we got this whole bag of clothes and an iron. So, who iron stuff anymore? Oh, and the microwave. So, between the microwave, the coffee maker, as long as it's in there, it looks like it's pretty much in there. This, like I said, twenty five. The 50, I'll have to look and see what they're going for. That's 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110. And I don't even have a clue what we might get for the shoes. It's going to make more than worth it right there. So get this to the house, get it loaded up, get this back to the house. And uh, yeah, we'll see. There might be a lot of high and expensive clothes in there. So this is a, there's a college close. So this looks like somebody moved out of a dorm. And never came back for their stuff. So. Alright, we'll be back here in a few minutes. I gotta go uh, get my deposit. Alright, back here with the stuff out of the storage unit. And wanted to go through this bag. Uh, seen everything else that was there. Um, the TV, the fridge. Uh, this little coffee maker. Which uh, I don't think I mentioned before. I looked this coffee maker up. It's a $50 coffee maker, and it was uh, brand new. Wasn't sure if that was the factory seal with the tape or not. But, yeah, it ended up being the factory seal, never out of the box. So, that was a pretty good find right there. But, as I said, this was the, the little bag. That's just sheets and beddings. So, I'm going to go through this bag real quick and see what we got. All right, so we're off the bat. I'm... Guessing this was drawn on there. I'm not really completely sure. But some kind of pants. I don't know if they're a good brand or not. You can see there's the brand there. Whatever that is. Yeah. So if you know if that's a good brand, if there's any value to those, let me know because uh, I don't have a clue. How bad? I always look at the, the bottom. They don't look that bad. As far as being heavily worn or anything. That uh, toy's creepy. This. I saw another one of these. I think this is like a marching band thing. You can tell it's heavily used. For like beating the drum or something. Yeah. Not really sure, but I think that's what it is. It's kind of neat. Uh, saw this already. It's an iron. It's like a dollar or two maybe. I don't know what iron goes for. Uh, okay, used 
trimmers. I guess some. Yeah, it's in there. Use it for the dog. Shave the dog, maybe. Uh. Okay. What is that? Some kind of pouch with. I don't know what those things are. Natural something or others. Throw it to the side. Uh, we got. Hey, there we go. We got a DVD. Is it in there? There it is. Cool. It says Michael B. Jordan. Sylvester Sloan. Yeah, never heard of that movie, but whatever. Cool. Uh. Shirts, clothes, nothing fancy looking. Oh, there's another pair of fancy somethings, uh, but they're cut off. Maybe they come like that. I don't know. I don't, I don't know a bunch about clothes. Beaten rhythm, which uh, that kind of ties into the whole uh, where it says this is the drumstick thing. More just clothes. Hopefully these are clean. I just thought of that. That'd be pretty terrible if they're not. Close. Uh, got something down in there. Probably should have had some lights. Especially from my reaching. We got here black web. Uh, yeah, holding this one hand stuff is not working out. These for like earbuds? Uh, it's empty. Oh, that sucks. Okay. Athlete's foot stuff, yeah. It's always good to have. It's a spray can, so you can reuse it. So that important paperwork. I think that might have been a name. Yeah, we'll edit that out. So we'll edit that out. We'll, we'll look through the important paperwork folder later. I gotta edit out that name, though. All right, uh, there's something in here. Let me pull this out. Holy cow, check this out. I didn't know what this was. I was like, eh, it says Nintendo on it. Open it up, and we have a Game Boy. That's cool. Let's see if it turns on. Uh, turned a little switch. No. Oh, cool. It's got a game in it, though. What is that? Jimmy Neutron. And then check this out. Check this out. I don't know what it is exactly. But it says Xbox. Yeah, you can tell I'm sad. It's sad. I'm not a gamer at all. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm assuming it's it. Is this one of the new Xboxes? Xbox. Okay. Xbox One S. So, holy... That's awesome. I think this is a gaming console. Like an Xbox One gaming console. Wow. I did not expect that. Is that the... Uh, I'm guessing this is the current Xbox. I don't know. I feel really stupid now because uh, I'm so not a gamer. Let's not put that there. Let's put it up here. I don't want that to fall. That's awesome. Uh, yeah, that... Remember, I only paid, what, 70 bucks for this whole unit? Uh, give me just a second, and we'll be right back again. I'm going to fold this bag down some. Yeah, okay. That, that was super exciting. We got here. Just got some axe. Nobody cares. So we got the TV. We got an Xbox. I wonder if we got controllers and games. Some more axe. Yeah, somebody wants to stay fresh. Look at that. All day fresh. All right. <laughs> more axe. All day fresh. Uh, come on, we need some games and stuff. What do we got here? Uh, a hat. More clothes. I don't know what that is. Is that like a blanket? Yeah. Uh, here's something. What is this? Anybody know? Uh, who we got? Clothes, auto, sound. I have no idea. Some kind of projector thing? Yeah, anybody's got a clue what this is? 
Looks like it might be a projector. It says something about lasers. Boy exposure, radio, laser radiation. Maybe it's something that projects on the ceiling and does like white noise or something too. I don't know. Huh. Sleep machine kind of thing. Uh, eh, I just got a three pack of the axe. Cool. Uh, somebody was a hat wearer. I don't know if hats are worth money or not. Look that. that looks like a crazy looking hat though. So if you know anything about hats or if these are worth anything. Uh, what's that? It's got the stickers on it. Detroit sticker on it. Puma. Another Detroit. New York. Detroit. That's a fancy looking one. Okay. I mean, the hats can sell. I used to collect hats, but not like this. Sorry about my terrible camera angle. I'm on a tripod right now. And yeah, K-State. So, it looks like a, what I said before about this being a college kid. Or man. Uh, looks more and more like it might be true. Nah. Uh, and more hats out of there. It's another Detroit one. Maybe I'll lot these up. Don't be afraid of Detroit. Uh, I mean, those are good words, but I think we all are a little bit afraid of Detroit. Uh, all right, let me roll this bag down a little more. All right, uh, got it rolled down some more. And honestly, the rest of this just looks like clothes. Yeah, I don't see anything else exciting in here but you know hey uh that xbox i mean yeah i think that's gonna be a good find right there and maybe there's a game in there i mean i don't have any remotes or any cords or cables though for it so i can't even test it out but i know people that are big gamers actually i uh, got that power i got that kind of power cord sure of it and i got hdmi cables is all we need i don't have to have to phone a friend and ask about that but yeah that's all we got and then, like i said got this thing where that sound and light thing is so all right well overall definitely gonna say uh made some money on this one uh i figured at first it was just gonna be a few bucks and we still don't know what those uh shoes might go for I mean, with those Nikes on eBay and or yeah, they were the Jordans. Throw those on eBay and see what happens. Maybe start out with ten bucks and just let it go. Uh, the mini fridge, the TV, microwave. I mean, that's even at twenty bucks a piece. It's two four six. Uh, coffee maker. If I can get twenty for it, like I said, it's a fifty dollar coffee maker, brand new. It's eighty. Uh, whatever the shoes make and whatever that uh xbox is worth and actually like i said a lot of those hats look really good shape looks like they might be brand new uh selling a lot for, uh you know 10 detroit hats Let's see what happens so i know some hats are like what 20 30 bucks at least 20 bucks a piece so do 10 hats if i can get two dollars a piece out of them it's another 20 bucks there and uh like i said i don't know what the xbox is worth i'd say 50 maybe 100 bucks i'm guessing uh let me know if you have a clue so overall i think this is a great buy i'm definitely gonna probably i'm gonna say double my money i only had 70 bucks into it i can see 120 bucks 140 bucks coming out of this thing and i can use that but towards my next one that's the plan you just start small build up keep doubling your money and you don't get to pay yourself for your time right you know at first but hey Gotta start somewhere. And I mean, I got another bunch of other stuff to sell in the garage. Yeah, yeah, you can see we got a, I got a big, huge wraparound full of all kinds of goodies I still haven't got rid of yet. Still haven't listed. Uh, yeah, there's a shelf full of stuff over there. Uh, actually, where is it at? These boots right now. I got. I finally listed those on eBay. And uh, I put 25 bucks. I think it was a starting bid. 
got $25 bid on it right now. There's a uh, 10 hours left, I think, until it's over. But there's also 10 people watching it, so it might go for a few bucks. And that was on my first unit where I got the two TVs, and I wanted that. Which, uh, that will be in this playlist, same playlist this thing's on. So, alright, that's it for this one. Uh, yeah. Now that I found that Xbox, I'm gonna have to look at and see how much it is, like I said. Very excited. And check out some of this other stuff. The little Nintendo. Uh, give it to the kids. So, have a good one. Oh, like, share, subscribe. Yeah, cause, uh, I'll be getting these, uh, from time to time. Hopefully, here soon, more often. We get a, I'm gonna get a shipping container as the plan and have a place to store all this stuff and take my garage back because, yeah. All right. Have a great day.